video, guys. So a few days ago, well, first of all, if you're following on my Instagram, which you should be, same name as my YouTube, MarvelKid87, I posted a picture of the Legends Revo Arc suspension. I relocated them, the, the reservoirs to the top. For some reason, everyone took it as a surprise, like, oh, wow, you just got those, you just got those? Like, I've, I've been had these down here tucked for a long time already, and I made a video about it, and I posted several pictures, so... I don't, I don't think you guys are doing the proper following if you're catching my drift. Anyways, they're on top. They look great. Uh, they, they, it, it just changed the whole dynamic of the bike in the back. Um, tell me what you guys think. Do you like them on top? Or um, if you didn't know, they were tucked in down here before. Um, they were visible from a point. You were still able to adjust them, so I had the easy access to do that even without taking the bags off. Um, but obviously, you know, like th this just gives a bike in the back a more aggressive look. It looks cool. You know, right now it's it's, it's, it's the thing as well. Um, Legends was pretty nice enough to also send me the uh, a different color sticker as well. So I know we all know the blue Legends logo sign, but if you want, obviously you get the logo in gold and blue and black. Um, I had the option to go with the red trim on top, which looks great. It's more of like an orangey red, which is fine. I'm not mad about that because if you didn't know, this bike does have an orange strip that goes around the black right here. Um, and also on my seat, I have an orange uh, uh, low, um, circle that goes around the Lucky Dave's logo with the red stitch on it. So it just, it kind of, it's like kind of coming all together very, very, very good. Um, but yeah, Legend Suspension, the Revo Arcs, I've had them on my bike for the past few months. Um, they feel great. Um, the ride is very, very plush. It took me a while to kind of dial it in, you know, set that sag properly where exactly where I want it to be at, um, and just have that perfect comfort. Um, that's the best thing about the, the Legend Suspension guys, that whenever you want, you can tweak them up. If, let's say, this weekend's coming up and you want to do some more aggressive riding and you want more of a stiffer ride, you can definitely change that up just by twisting these knobs um, and it's so simple as that so whenever you want uh, want to have a different type of feel type of different ride style you can change that up um, also if you're planning on maybe <clears throat> adding a passenger on in the back if you have more of a heavier load you can um, obviously adjust that uh, to have that super super comfort uh, for your passenger in the back where you know you're gonna you have to worry about your suspension bottoming out anything like that so obviously huge huge shout outs to ledges by the way still because yeah i love these things they look absolutely great and i really regret not putting them on top in the beginning at first uh, well at first if you saw that video you saw that I, I i opened the box i installed everything i couldn't find the brackets to install everything on top not knowing that i kind of pushed it to the side and was next to the garbage so I was like, well, let me just install it in the bottom. And that's what happened this whole time. And then I found it and I was just lazy to do it. Um, it's, it's a really, really simple job to do. Um, I, I just didn't want to do it myself. So huge shout out to Eddie. Eddie was the one that fixed my uh, RLNS risers. He cleaned everything up in there. He's like the magician when it comes to stuff like that. Um, so if you guys are in the uh, New Jersey, New York area, if you're looking for any parts you want to do something to your bike uh hit up eddie uh, i'll link up his um information down below so you guys can reach out to him he's about to do uh, a few bar setups for two of my boys and uh, a few little things here so shout out to eddie now with all that being said i have no regrets about my legend suspension on my 2021 road glide um it rides amazing feels great plush and it's, it's i have it dialed in just perfectly 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 guys i just wanted to touch base and show you guys exactly how the reservoirs looked on top they absolutely look amazing if you got yours on the bottom trust me bring them up to the top they look cool um i know i'm gonna get some questions so can i still run uh, a docking hardware with this on top yes you can i don't have my docking hardware on because i haven't bought it yet but i'm gonna buy it soon but you can run your docking hardware and then have your reservoirs on top um the brackets come with two options 
Um, there's one for a taller option like this one, which I chose the taller one. I said taller, the taller one. And then there's a, a shorter bracket, which is gonna bring your, your reservoir a bit lower. I think a little better like that on top. So yes, if I have my dock and hardware, I'm still able to put a sissy bra on there or a backrest, whatever it is. So no complaints there. Can you add a, let's say a tour pack? I can't answer that question. I don't know, I haven't tried it. For those of you guys who have tried it and have the answer, drop it down below in the comments. That's gonna be it. Like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe, enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.